Space. The final frontier. The end goal of human engineering. Our mission? To explore strange new worlds, to seek out new life and new civilizations, to boldly go where no man has gone before. Too bad we'll all be dead before that happens. It's no secret that Earth has had multiple extinction events. All these cool reptiles? Volcanoes. All the cool fish? Algae. The dinosaurs? Big ass space rock. There have been five known extinction events over the course of hundreds of millions of years. But did you know there's a sixth extinction event? Yeah, neither did I. I wonder when it was. Uh-oh. So what is the sixth extinction? Big surprise, it's the direct result of human activity on Earth. But Cole, what do you mean by human activity? Well... I mean all of it. For millions of years, we have hunted animals in and out of water, changed approximately 70% of the land, and polluted water. Three-fourths of fresh water is being used by humans. And we've even somehow managed to change the climate, but that's old news. When was the last time you haven't heard about California being on fire? We've known that we've been messing up the Earth's general well-being for decades, but it seems like no one cares. In the past hundred years, more than 400 vertebrate species have gone extinct. Without human interference, this would have taken 10,000 years. For those playing along at home, that's right, we are also vertebrates. Like I said, we've known about our effects on the Earth for a while now. Right now, we are emitting more carbon emissions than ever before. Remember those volcanoes I was talking about earlier? Well, while the volcanoes obviously killed a lot of life, it's the carbon emissions and their effect on the climate that killed even more. That's what the sixth extinction is, the globe getting too hot. So. How do we stop it? Well, we probably can't unless we start right away. Let's make a checklist, shall we? We have to switch to electric cars, stop cutting down the rainforest, reduce greenhouse gases to virtually zero, actively remove carbon from the atmosphere, and a bunch of other stuff. So yeah, not looking great. The best thing we can do is prepare to adapt to the coming change. Bye!